Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. This is Emi Chicken from Team Pandori. Recently, we've made a review on the Taito Egra 2 Mini. While it's not a bad product, it has its fair share of issues, many of which are being ignored by the larger YouTube channels. So uh, you suck, donkey ball. If you'd like to see more critical reviews that go against the grain, please Let's like, subscribe, and bell. bell. The simplest hack would be to use one of these portable batteries. Stick it on the back of your cab, and you'll be able to bring it into the park. Perfect for Hanami. It's me, John Luke. Let's get trashed. If we're talking real hacks, let's check out Slinky Ramane on Twitter. He's been responsible for the Game Gear micro hack, as well as working on the Mega Drive mini hack known as Project Luna. Recently, he's had his eyes set on the Egret 2 Mini. With stripping down his machine, he's managed to decrypt the firmware after finding a password by using reverse encryption software. Flipping heck, I'm getting hard. He has now full access to the machine. What's more, he's unlocked and altered the SD card. Arkanoid now plays without the paddle. The inbuilt emulator plays Pudger Carrot in English. He's added VVVVVV. And is that RetroArch? <laughs> According to Slinky Ramane, he considers the Egret 2 Mini to be fully hacked and has no current ETA for installation package for the end user. He told me that if it's going to take a long time, he might just release the Memboot and SSH install, and hopefully if he can, RetroArc and a menu. Needless to say, this is great news. If you want to give him support, follow him on Twitter, and maybe throw him a few coffees. We've left links in the video description down below, and we'll catch you next time. Ta-ra! We wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. E